Welcome to another session of Issues in Education. I'm Dennis Young. I have with me uh, Rachel Mann, who is the founder of Teach Like Ted. Uh, and we're here in the middle of the atrium of the National Conference of uh, ISTE, which is the International Society for Technology for Education. So how many sp different exciting spaces have you seen? Well, I work within a lot with career technical education, oh, okay. and I see some amazing spaces because it's a, sometimes partnering with business and industry and having like aviation programs where planes have been donated for kids to work on oh, and I really see. learn yeah. learn it. I, I see uh, culinary arts programs where they're giving kids this whole mystery basket concept that's like kept comparable to chopped. Yeah. Where they're giving them some crazy ingredients and these kids are coming up with these masterful pieces. They don't even realize how much <laughs> science they're learning yeah. and even engineering, you know, yeah. engineering yeah. food. Yeah. Uh, so, so it's just really, it is fascinating. I don't think people see what is already happening in some of our education spaces uh -huh. and how we can even take that to that next level and, and make uh, education as a whole exciting where kids want to go to school each day. Do, do the teachers that you work with know some programs like uh, SketchUp, which is available to them, free? It's a free version? See, and that's, I don't think that we, if there's, like having this conference where we have 20,000 educators coming uh -huh. together, we need more of this. Because I think there are times when you see uh, teachers who are, uh, they are using, giving out packets still, they don't know what's available. Sometimes the people who are going to the conferences are administrators and folks that it's not tr it's supposed to be this trickle down learning and it doesn't happen it doesn't right. make it back to educators right. so making them knowledgeable about SketchUp and these awesome tools mm -hmm. they it, and how they can <laughs> use it in the classroom so teachers are so busy how do we give them those tools and make it to where it's just like look at how you can apply it in your area interesting it would be a neat challenge to give kids the uh, a program to how would you design your perfect classroom or your perfect school and see what they would come up with oh, and let them collaborate be... let Absolutely. them collaborate among themselves well you know and as i think about that that whole student agency piece again yeah, yeah, is yeah. like using having yeah. the kids learn the tool and then the the teachers the teachers give them the tool how can we use this for this subject area because the Wouldn't kids it be exciting. Yeah.